happening part of the intent because the same thing happened out in in williamsburg oh well, it's uh, happened all over uh, the country uh, actually absolutely it's, yeah, it's yeah. much of but this particular mm. piece yeah, yeah 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 is like what happened up in the south bronx right right it got burned out uh -huh. but now they're doing it at a more rapid race mm -hmm. also the mayor has cut back on the number of fire marshals uh -huh. so the fire marshals have been cut back from about 223 to now about a hundred mm -hmm. so there's no way that's a that big that, drop. That's a big drop. Yeah. There's no way that they can follow up by checking all of these different mm -hmm. fires to find out if there's arson right. going on. Because yeah. if there's arson going on, and there is some arson, mm -hmm. I'm sure going on, mm -hmm. where people are burning people out mm -hmm. and then taking over these buildings, putting them back together, yeah. and and they say, well, you can't say that. Yes, I can. Yeah, you can say. I can you say. You, say I said they can't loudly. prove it. And they can't prove that it's not. On top of everything else, now, and if they want to do that, if they want to take that attitude, they can do it subtly by taking fire engines away to let things burn. Then, if the, or if they set a new standard and say you get a little crack in the wall, we're going to tear that building down. They're doing all or, of those and types of things. Now they've got the Supreme Court just yeah. passed the thing, eminent domain. Eminent Government domain. agencies can take over for business interests over the rights of the people who are living there in order to set up something and that's a very dangerous kind of intrusion upon, upon uh, the rights of the citizens of this country I'm and it's going to fall inordinate as everything does on the least advantage in our society that's you go, they just passed a bankruptcy law that right. falls on the in, uh, you know right so that's why with that what you're talking about about the eminent domain issue is why my candidacy uh -huh. is so important for uh -huh. people in Harlem because what I'm saying, mm -hmm. okay, two can play this game. Mm -hmm. Let's take eminent domain and reverse it. Mm -hmm. Let's say that we're going to use eminent domain. Eminent domain is supposed to be able to take properties from people mm -hmm. to provide for the public's good. What I'm saying yeah, is, let's, gear, but wait a minute. Uh -huh. No, no, listen. Ahead, yeah, we sure. take the Talk. property uh -huh. from the city. Uh -huh. These abandoned and vacant buildings that yeah. the city control, yeah. that we take the property all over and, the place. And that are being warehoused and then uh, provide Squat them, for, them. A poor, uh, for affordable housing yeah. for poor seniors who need housing. Why should the mayor be allowed to sell these buildings where well, we can make big money? It's not just about money. Uh -huh. It's about a quality of life. Mm -hmm. Yes, you look at New York City and it's beautiful. Look at it, how it's growing and developing. Mm -hmm. yeah. But the quality of life mm -hmm. is still decreasing. Mm -hmm. And it's about how well we live, mm -hmm. not how well we live. What did you say? It, it's about how well we live, how well we live, not uh -huh. how well. In other words, not, it's not about how, how, much, how many yachts we have or how many condominiums oh, I see. Are that yeah, yeah. we have. But are we living well? Are we, are we able to, to, to exist, coexist also, with one another? Also, are we taking care of the Gospels, if I'm not mistaken, is always one of the major charges of all the Gospels, of all the spiritual traditions is be concerned with the least among you, and Absolutely. they seem not to be concerned with the least among us, either on a national or an international scale at all. It's all geared toward those who already are well Their to God is in greed is good. It is, and that's, it's not. That's their whole philosophy. Oh, what about the idea that, uh, you know, that there are some, let's just say you take a thing, you say some people are greedy and bad, and then some people are good and care, and then there's a certain group that represent the, the, the ones who care and so but what happens when you see the two in bed together in this case I would say the Democrat and Republican Party well so and you and yeah. they're gonna wait their turn and they will let the tax cut go through they'll do the war they won't follow they won't uh, have any uh, real systems uh, opposition to the thing and everything because they're waiting patiently for their turn in order to get their chance to milk the people. To milk the people. Absolutely. And I mean, it's like mafia gangs. We need to you bring... Know, you got the, the Bugsy Moran yeah. gang or the... And they're making money off and of war materials. And they're making money and taking care of the rich. Yeah. And not doing anything that's including right. the least it's, advantage it's among us. National, it's in terms of city, nationally see, or internationally. And that's not a very good uh, pattern to be set for saying we're going to create a full spectrum dominance got a of this whole got a world in order to improve and have that kind we've of We've got a system. problem with AIDS. Mm -hmm. We've got a problem now perhaps with this horrible, this horrible flu that might be coming around mm -hmm. that's going to destroy people. God Public may have convinced. We don't understand what's in the, in the minds. Mm -hmm. There may be a young child walking down the streets of Harlem right now mm -hmm. that's in a homeless shelter mm -hmm. that may have the seed planted in his mind for the uh -huh. cure for cancer. We don't know what we are holding down mm -hmm. when we're holding down. Mm -hmm. So it's, it's to the benefit of all of society yeah, to right. let all of the society develop mentally, emotionally, sure to, to fit back into 
Who no, knows? It, it may be absolutely crucial. I'm not sure if I ever went through Theodore Woody or not, but there's a, there, you know, in a human organ, did I go through this with you? In a human organism, there are 100 trillion cells in a human I, there's organism. There's a, there's an exhibit. 100 trillion. There's an exhibit all, coming around. And they all matter. Every one. There's Every a, one. There's an exhibit going to be coming around. I saw oh, it in Chicago at the yeah. Museum of Science and Industry called The Body World, mm -hmm. where they have, they sliced the body up to show you all the intra workings of the body, and it shows people the, 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 how what the damage that cigarette smoke does to yeah, the inside right, of the body. Right. Uh, it shows how you realize that this is a magnificent unit that we're in. Can you, and for did you hear what I put, said? I did a hundred trillion. trillion. And let me tell you about a And trillion. they all work me, as a system, and they all matter. If you got one cell, you're going, it's cancer. So you need an analogy to that kind of God's system or something for the whole, everybody, they're going to have to be awakening somehow that it can't be just for the already powerful. Everything geared to that. Everything is geared to that. Everything, all the financing is set up to get more to those who are already wealthy. The law protects those who are already powerful. That kind of thing. And it all of humanity and all of the people in a body politic or something, everybody matters and everybody, everybody has to be. Matters. And it hasn't dawned yet. That's why Democracy is not yet broken out on planet Earth and maybe no. it needs to. Yeah. And maybe your party that you're forming could be a seed that could help uh, right. uh, uh, bring right. that happy it, day it could be the uh, forward. It could be the one. Just okay. like I said, that little piece that's fit in there. Hmm. It's like we live here in what's called the universe. It's really interesting. And the English language is a beautiful thing. Yeah. Uni means one. Yeah. Verse is a part of a song. Yeah. So each one of us in this verse, uh -huh. each one of us is a note. Uh -huh. And once each note gets in harmony, yeah. we'll have a song. That's what and we that want. song will be peace. Hey, but so right we now need we're, to have that. Yeah, but right now we're all singing. We're all having these solos singing. We all do a solo. It's all solos. And yeah. you're not getting any of the people in the and chorus. And the people who are trying to bring harmony yeah. uh -huh. into, into play mm -hmm. are those, again, who are the lesser of. Mm -hmm. There is something, I don't know, evil forces, for a lack of another, another word. Uh -huh. um, well, uh, outdated and inefficient. It's so inefficient yeah. to have this system, not, not just at the level of justice, but from a system's perspective, it's unhealthy and unnecessary it's and outdated, and it's got to go. It's a, it's got, it's a, it's a maggot it's like man mentality. It's like slavery had to go. It's a maggot man mentality that the American, f f the, the, the American way is. Um, for instance... The uh, world, the world. The, well, there's the world. no place where yeah. they don't have a plutocratic class absolutely. that run rampant absolutely. over the people. Absolutely, yeah. Everywhere absolutely. in the world, Greed like is always has been, th is what and controls. so there's something new blowing in the wind now. Yeah. It may be the War Veterans Party. And it's certainly, if we can have the War Veterans people, especially all you veterans out there, yeah. all of those of you who are vets, you have a vested interest in having a voice in City Hall, mm -hmm. a voice that'll speak for you, a voice through which your issues can be brought forward. Right. Because certainly, wow. veterans, Mm -hmm. know better than anybody the horrors that of war, war is hell. And it was Mr. Eisenhower who told us to guard against the the, ind the you know the military industrial complex, complex absolutely. which seems very nicely to have captured the heart and soul of this country what do we call right it, Halliburton, now. Halliburton? Uh, well, Halliburton is yeah. a great but no but the military industrial right. complex is the cabal that's running the world. Right and but there's the Halliburton's oh. are running that. Yeah, that's right, what's running. Right. I mean, that's why they've yeah. got all of this money in there where they're running overseas now and all of this money. If, it's like a balloon. Uh -huh. Money is like a balloon. When they say we don't have money for education, we don't have money for health care, we don't have money for food and, and decent housing, it's like a balloon. When you squeeze it over here, it goes over there. Yeah. So there's never a time that there's not enough money for education. Mm -hmm. It's just that it's being spent in the wrong places. We've got to stop spending money on uh, war efforts. Yeah. We've got to start spending money on the reunification and the rehabilitation of children and families. So on yeah. November the 8th, you have a chance to make a difference. Let's shake up the system, come out to the polls, and do something different in New York. And vote for Woody Henderson. Absolutely. Line 6. Line 6. Of the District uh, District 9. Council, District 9. That's right. I don't think they could do better. Good luck, young man. I hope the heck you can pull it off. And I really thank you very much I for coming. I hope we can pull it off. Uh, it's yeah, about right. the people. All right. It's yeah, really you all can pull it right. off. And I'm happy to have been able to, from a small way, help. It's always fun. And interesting talking to Woody Henderson. I really appreciate your coming in talking, Woody, and all the best. Thank you so much. And if one other thing, I just like people, to, if you want to know more about me, go to the Internet and uh. Google my name. Uh. Just type in Woody Henderson and Foster Care, Woody Henderson and Family Court, Woody Henderson and oh. Amadou Diallo. And let's not, oh, yeah, no, we didn't get into that. Right. I mean, yeah, but you just type my I name know. in and yeah, put my yeah, name with yeah. those names, yeah, Woody Henderson got, and Al Sharpton. 
and your, all of that information will come up. Your reputation and your resume precede you, as they say, and everything. And you're also going to be likely having a meeting uh, today. This is going to be aired on the Thursday, mm -hmm. and you're likely to be having a gathering. Maybe you can get in and, quick. Oh yes, in front of, we're going to have a press conference today at uh, about one o'clock at the uh, at, at, at 23rd and First Avenue in front of the VA hospital. Oh, All you good, vets come good, down good there. We go, we're going to stop George Bush from closing that hospital. Good down. About what, 12 noon, uh, 1 o'clock. Yeah. On this very day you view this program, everybody go down. The number 16 bus takes you right there. Okay. Okay, good. Right. Thanks again. Thanks again, Harold. Right. Thanks for even coming back again tomorrow, and uh, we'll be coming back then. So I tell you, so, uh, and your website's still up, right? What is it? Uh, it's uh, ajuststruggle.com. Ajust. Struggle. That's what we're involved not in. Not just a, a struggle, but a, a just, just struggle. struggle. It's not just I mean, a it's struggle. It's a play on words. I like it. it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But it's anyway, I, I hope they didn't And it's out. also, we have to adjust the struggle. That's right. You can bit really, by bit. this is but getting to be yeah. like hip hop and words. Yeah, you, you know, know it might be like another game of, uh, yeah. of, uh, of like, like um, crossword puzzle. Yeah, yeah, Adjust yeah. struggle, just the struggle. No, but these words make, uh, these kind of poetic words make yeah. a difference. That's a lot of what the it's, hip hop it's thing is about. It's poetic justice. Yeah, poetic, again. You see, we're yes. just sitting here yeah. making up all yeah, these trademarkable kind of ideas. We can go out on the road Maybe get you elected, yeah. Yeah. You may be heading for the White House, young man. Hey.